Because you and Dre was pretty much production partners. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Because y'all did everything together. I mean, from the beginning, from right. DJing all the, way, all the way to the end. Most of the ruthless stuff. You ever think about, man, you could have been a part of some of them other albums? <laughs> Not really. Because like the DLC. He said, man, I'm going to work on a DLC album. I'm good. We, we had just finished our album on a Friday. And on Monday, you want to go back to the studio? Our stuff? Nah, I'm good. Uh-huh. Michelle A., same thing. I'm good. Yeah, but then you did your mom, Nalki. That's because Dre didn't want to do it. Right. And they looking at me. Okay, you do it. I'm like, okay. I liked it, that album. That was the shit. They got yeah, caught up. What you saying? Yo Mo and Mark. Yo Mo and Mark. Oh, yeah. That was the they shit, was all man. Mockingbird yeah. and all that shit. You know what's so I funny? For the love of For the love of money is the same well, y'all original had, well, track. Well, they had it first, though. That's what I'm Yo saying. Yo Mo and Marky yeah. had I, For the Love of Money. I made first. that, and it's the same track. And I guess. Why did Easy decide to use it again? I guess he let Bone hear it. Mm hmm. And I guess they just, boom, muted their vocals. Because it was already out. Yeah. Like, yeah. That, that was like the years, first time I've eight, ever seen that. Years, like eight. some shit like yeah. that. Yeah. I mean, like you see it commonly now with remixes and people mm-hmm. using them. But back then, that was like. It was unheard like, of. It was unheard that of. That was the crazy part about it. You know how that was? That was kind of like with that one record, too. That I, I got the power. You know, we had the two people oh, rapping oh, yeah, the same yeah, beat. Yeah, they did have. Oh, Rob G. Chill Rob yeah, G. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Snap. Yes. Snap. Yeah. Snap. And Snap was actually like a Euro group, like, yeah. a, like a Euro group, like a Euro dance group or some shit like that. Yeah. I always like shit. Yeah, but that was the, the, the same. Yeah, it was the it was the it was the same fucking track. Right. Like, you know what? It, much later, but it reminded me with uh, Scarface with Mary Jane mm-hmm. and Shanti with Baby. Mm-hmm. I was like, wait. That's just literally the instrumental of Scarface. So people started doing it then, like fuck, yeah. you know. But <laughs> like, like I said yeah. back then, I was like. Damn, they using the same <laughs> and fucking then, beat. And then like. Dre used it on the Compton album later mm. for, the, uh, for the soundtrack. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He, uh, inspired by yeah. album, I should say. <laughs> mm-hmm. Yeah. That's so, too. and I ain't going to ask you, because you're going to have a million people ask you about your opinion of the movie. It ain't about the opinion, but more like, do you think the character they had in the movie actually reflected your personality? Yeah. I, I was, it was about the, the women. It wasn't about the money. Yeah. It was about the women. So you was really out there chasing the women. What? <laughs> I don't you know if I was Ella saying I didn't well, know what well, Jason. Huh? Jason, I, I be a little strong. Jason, being, <laughs> being in being in NWA at that time, because like I said, I can attest from even from putting out my first single in a video. Wasn't too hard. Yeah. For, <laughs> yeah, yeah, Jason, nothing. <laughs> And but at that, that and at that time, just being from Compton, yeah, just just oh yeah, one Compton got the name. I mean, oh, just being from Compton yeah. and just I mean, shit, Compton was it was exciting itself with all the women and yeah. shit and whatever, and then to be able to go on the road and motherfuckers do all watch that. videos and all that shit, man, it was just man. Did you ever get married? Yeah. Are you married? You married now? Oh, yeah, 10 years. 10 years, man. Oh, yeah. Congratulations. And I never wanted to get married. You know, once I did, that was that was it for me. I'm, I'm good. Them, them old games. And, yeah, yeah. It, it, you uh, know, you have your fun and it tire you out, and then you get to a position to where, like, fuck it, I'm a grown-up now, you know, and shit. <laughs> and I would I like mean, to assume that you had your, your, your feel of fun. Oh, yeah. I mean, see, I could talk about mines, but... Yeah, Everybody did. <laughs> mm-hmm. But I'm gonna put myself. I've been a couple the of pool parties and everything, man. Shit, it was very fucking exciting, man. Yeah, I heard yeah. about them. Did pool you come party. to the pajama party? I didn't come to the pajama oh, party. Oh, you sick? Oh. Nah, man, that was too <laughs> treacherous for me, man. You went I, to the pool parties, right? I went to both. You know, the pool you know parties, the pool parties man. was set up. The contest. They were strippers. Of course they were. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I knew a couple of them. They were just... I knew a couple of them later <laughs> oh, okay. on. Yeah, 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 yeah. Later, <laughs> later. Yeah. I went to both pool parties, Oh, yeah. Man. Motherfuckers was... That was crack. ahead of their time right there. That was something. That you was know the thing crack. about them pool parties, though, man? One that was out in Malibu, nigga. That yeah. motherfucker was cracking. <laughs> What's oh, the weirdest thing God, you ever saw man, them pool parties? That shit was cracking. Uh, it all, man. Oh, man. <laughs> You saw it all. <laughs> We'd be arrested. For I was a young nigga. <laughs> I was a young nigga too. Had no business in them motherfucker. But I'm like nigga, see him dubbed out in that bitch, and it was just like, 
God damn, this bitch is everywhere, hey, this motherfucker. Let me ask you this, man. Was there ever any issues about dudes, women being up there, dudes coming up there looking for their girls and shit, their wives? Nah, nah. We just did our thing. Well, y'all didn't give a damn. Wives, whoever, man, man, girlfriends. Fuck, yeah, man. This shit was exquisite. Man. <laughs> you ain't never had nobody. You ain't never had nobody front you off like, man. You been nobody messing never my girl. came. I mean, you couldn't get in the studio because it had bar gate, but mm -hmm. nobody. Nah, didn't have no issue. She was just gone. If you, if you had, it was just over it was with. Over with. You want to take your ass on home and chill out and just do whatever. That's some cold it's, shit. It's, it's but his favorite thing was. Is that your girl? Don't say it's your girl. Yeah, because this team is gone. Yeah. I said, hey, my girl. I'm Keep just your girl away from Keep your girl away from out. <laughs> he won't you mess with it. Don't say that. Well, he was girl. something else, boy. Me and him used to go battle. We used to have a thing called a point system on the road. Mm -hmm. You know, the full thing is a whole point or a little half a point or mm -hmm. a little bitty point. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Put them on Once the point system. Once he got... 10 points in one night, the game was over. Oh, we done. We, we ain't messing with you. 10 points in one night, damn. <laughs> Pinocchio, we gon' tell you the truth and nothing but the truth. Extra chronic, this is not your average show. Like 